the other day I ordered some Lush products online. I've never been to a Lush store, so it was the first time that I've got any Lush products. I got um, six or seven, five or six or seven soaps and some lip products, and that's in this bin up here. So I'll start with the soaps, and I'll start from my least favorite soap to my favorite soap. My least favorite soap is um, Angel's Delight. Angel's Delight is tangerine, grapefruit, and mango leaf, and looks like that. It has the tangerine right here. I gave it to my mom because she likes it, but I really didn't like the smell. I like tropical fruits, but... I don't know, it's growing on me, but at first it was too strong and overpowering. The next soap is um, Vanilla in the Mist. Vanilla in the Mist is very soft and it's almost melting in my hand. And it comes with this embedded vanilla bean. And it does not smell like vanilla. It says it smells like coffee. It doesn't smell like coffee. It kind of smells like mocha. It smells like a dessert drink minus the coffee and a little bit of Play-Doh, but it's very soft and creamy. A vanilla bean right here. Um, so that's what it looks like. Next is Rockstar. Now when I first opened Rockstar, um, I wanted to return it. I thought it was the worst smelling thing ever. I wanted to return it. Now it smells so good to me. Like I use it in the shower and it smells so good. It says it smells like bubblegum. It does not. It smells like sweet tarts and baby powder. It looks like that. On the top, that's what it looks like. And it lathers really well. And it's really moisturizing, soft and creamy. The next one is ice blue soap. Ice blue soap is peppermint and um, sea salt soap. It's a really pretty blue. It's a nice chunk. Um... It smells like peppermint, but it doesn't smell like artificial peppermint. It smells like natural peppermint and sea salt, so it's like, I feel like when I, it's hard, so it's not as creamy. And I feel like when I wash with this, it's going to be, um, very invigorating and fresh. The next soap I got is a holiday soap, I believe, and that is Snow Cake. Snow Cake is a very white and opaque soap. Extremely creamy and soft, and it smells like almond frosting. Smells really good. There's the design on it. Okay. So yeah, that's that. And I have really bad skin. I have eczema. It's dry, itchy, and it gets cut open easily. So I'm hoping when I use this that my eczema will decrease. The last soap was must-have because everyone talks about it. And that is Honey, I Wash the Kids. It's a nice, perfect chunk. And it has honeycomb on top. You can see it. That's what it looks like. And from the side. It smells so good. I could just sit here and smell it all day. Um, it smells like caramel, honey, and coffee. It smells really good, and I wish that I could eat it. And it's really soft and creamy as well. We got four lip products. We got two lip scrubs and two lip tints. The other two lip scrubs that I got are bubble gum and mint juleps. And look like that. Now this first one does not smell like bubble gum to me. It smells like those hard banana candies. I really don't like the smell. So I gave it to my mom. That's what it looks like. It's very dry and sugary. I gave it to my mom because I really don't like that smell. On the other hand, this mint juleps one smells like, it says it's peppermint with chocolate sugar crystals. So it smells exactly like a peppermint patty or junior mints and that's what it looks like um i thought that these exfoliators were going to be um more moist but it's basically like dry sugar and a little bit of oil so you rub that on your lips and it exfoliates the dead skin off and then you lick it off which is kind of nasty because um you're eating your dry skin but it's okay because it tastes really good Okay, and the last two are the lip tints, and I got it in Snow Fairy, and it started with a kiss. And, okay, so Snow Fairy smells like the bubblegum lip tint, except 
a little bit different. And it's like this pink color. And it comes off. It's coming off pretty pigmented, but not that pigmented. If you can see it. Um, it's perfect for wearing during the daytime. Because it's not like a lipstick color, it's just like a soft pink color. But it smells like the hard banana candies again. Which I'm not too crazy about, but it's okay. And now it started with a kiss. Basically is Christmas in a tin. It smells like gingerbread houses, cinnamon can um, cinnamon candles, and vanilla. And it's crimson cranberry red color, so I think it suits any skin tone. And I don't like the taste of it because I think tasting cinnamony, like spicy things is weird. But it, it certainly smells amazing. Like this would make a great candle. And it comes off like that, so that's pretty pigmented. They're not moist. They're actually, I find they're very dry. But, yeah. So that's my last product. And I'm looking forward to going to the Lush store. Because I ordered these online, and ordering soaps online without smelling them first is probably not such a great idea. But I'm pretty happy with most of the products that I got. And I got about six soaps which would last a month and a half if I use one if I use a piece of one every day. And yeah. So basically that's it. Bye.